lovely, lovely day. Absolutely glorious weather here as we welcome you to a football match of considerable significance. Great consequence in this part of the world. They've been talking about this one for a while and they have rolled up to it in fantastic numbers. You should have seen the roads outside the ground in the hour or two leading up to it. It has been bumper to bumper. The traffic has been extraordinary. But the level of expectation is also very, very high. And uh, these supporters who uh, were queuing around the block for their tickets as soon as we knew the date of the fixture, well, now they can't wait for it to begin. And begin it will any second now. It truly is quite a sight to behold here. The Minerao amongst the largest stadia in this part of the world. Got things on the way. Taken a tries a shot. Oh, denied brilliantly. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Tries to locate someone up front. Anything, Jim, to pick out of these early exchanges? Well, neither side has really grabbed the initiative, I would say. Both must have come in with a view of, of not making any early mistakes. So we're seeing some conservatism here. Tries to get it forward quickly. It is deadlocked. Good challenge, he just stood firm. He goes long. Dangerous looking ball. And it's come to nothing. Keeps everyone guessing. Looking for a decent ball, it massively. Goal! Just so calm under pressure. Well, I think that defence there thought they were in good position and they had him where they wanted. Yet somehow he's worked the scoring position when it didn't see him on. It's really crafty business that. So we have our breakthrough. Still a fragile lead, though. They can't afford to sit on this. Hardly anything between the sides. And it's 1-0.
Recife are in control here on the brink of half time. Oh, that's clearly not what he wanted to do. Looks to bypass the midfield. That's a throw. He's left his man. Goes for the cross. And that is not finding anyone. Hoists it forward. And the first 25 minutes are up. And here we are. Off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half. But there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, this team has found a real rhythm to their game. The players seem to have clicked well. There's good movement off the ball. The passes are sticky. No one's afraid to have a go. Recife will have the lead in a tight old game. Half time, 1 0. And we are already promptly back on the way. Sport Recife going well here, and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit, but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. Just brushed off the ball there. Honda. Honda. Botafogo can't make any sort of inroad despite all this possession. And it's played forward. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. So, Jim, what are you thinking? Well, I'm inclined to feel that if I was in that dugout, I'd want the players to, to get on the front foot and grab another. Just try to, to make this one safe. Forward it goes. Tries to get it forward quickly. Tries lifting it over. Hoists it forward. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Botafogo keep the ball, but can't do anything meaningful with it. Cuts it out. away lovely control he made it stick with an excellent touch Final 
checks on the touchline. A change about to occur. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. Honda. Recife leading here by this still precarious 1-0 margin. Just a few more moments for them to hang on. That's been drilled forward. He's through, now is he in? Gorgeous control there. A chance to play it in. Shoots! That has certainly tested the keeper. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. And it's played forward. And that will be the final act. What a game. End to end, it flew by, and in the end, it all came down to just the odd goal. How do you look back on the game?